Okay. The next steps are lots and lots of these. <laughs> lots and lots of the uh, electric mining drills. So early game progression will be transitioning away from burner drills into setups for more automated production. This will be fun, by the way. This will be interesting because in the on the rails playthrough, if we can remember that far back, uh, there was this concept that was brought up to me. There was a concept brought up where one can do this. So, Pi Alien Life, I have not because it's I'm a patron on Patreon, but because I am one who is able to discover things. Crashes like what we had earlier with doing a search in Hellmod <laughs> crashed the game. Uh, so I have early access because I can offer feedback for balance purposes having because I do a lot of research of what I'm building I do a lot of planning of what I'm building and I am able to provide a level of feedback that's uh brought a lot of changes to the game to uh to the pie suite over time uh, so I'm doing that finding what's broken and all that good stuff the best place to watch for the release of pie alien life will probably be through the uh, community discord server which uh that currently has a link through the factorio forums someone's someone's been posting the uh the links to the community discord uh, on the factorio uh planet on forum so you can have a look there for that i guess i'll make uh, a link to this community. Uh, and post an invite link. So there's that's the that's a link for the Pi community Discord. If you are interested. Uh, a lot of stuff does get posted there. Uh, as well as through Pinedon's Patreon uh, for the info. So that would be the place that will be notified first when there is news about the release for Alien Life. I would think that that would be the very first place that would get uh, info. So this, as a concept, uh, note that we're going to have to do like a lot of smelting before having science. Like, we won't have science splitters or undergrounds for a long time so this is a very important concept that no one uses because in a normal vanilla playthrough you don't have to do this right that you won't ever have a situation really where this becomes a thing that you need to do so yeah, the, I, I'm very grateful that this was pointed out to me because it's just not something you think about is using inserters to move from one belt to another. That is a splitter. Makeshift splitter, by the way. That is that is how you can do splitting uh, in the early game. Without actually having splitters. We still don't have undergrounds. So... That is going to be a little bit problematic. Not having any undergrounds whatsoever. Now, I'm going to add a secondary one there because I'm pretty sure I'm going to need it. Okay, first things first. Uh, I will need to set it up. Oh, Ave, hi. You made it for the last 20 minutes of the stream. Yes, you, you have made it. This... This over here, Arkraven, this is the new resource added with Pi Alien Life. This is the bio reserve. These are trees and shrubs. This is this is this is 
the new resource that has been added to Pi Alien Life. And uh, it has its own miner called a collector. It has its own miner. And this resource is going to be required to get green science. You need this for green science now. As a new type of resource. Gosh, and I'm just thinking, the rest of my day today is going to be trying to set up a infinity mode map to make an overview video of uh, this alien life. Like, there is no chance I'm going to be able to cover literally everything in Pi Alien Life in a single overview video. It'll be, it'll definitely be overview. It won't even remotely close be able to cover everything, but I think guess I'll talk about, hey, science has massively changed. There's a new resource that you can collect. There's a whole bunch of complexity added with being able to handle the, uh, the alien life that you'll be handling in here. And there are a ton of recipes added and a ton of text added. Uh, and then I have to make new tutorials for the, for the sciences. That will be on its way at some point. New tutorials for all of the stuffs. Gosh, I'm limited by copper, huh? Yeah, because of course I am. Of course I'm limited by copper. Oh, Ave, have you have you seen the sciences yet, Ave? You have you seen uh have you seen red so just again brief brief mention this is red science yes at least now i have tar in the starting area unlike the uh on the rails playthrough so here's the uh here's the red science chain this is this is the red science chain The, this is the raw resources, quote unquote raw resources, um, required. Coke's gonna have to come from this recipe. Uh, so there's the there's the raw resources for 0.25. 0.25. Out on the red science. 0.25. Now, it would be great if I could just, like, say one... Oh, that... That's not quite... I guess it's 0.33 for the full... Yeah, I think it's 0.33 repeating for the assembling... One assembling machine one. So, yeah, that's that's the numbers. That's red science. Do do a one. Do it do it for one. Well, if I'm gonna be if I'm gonna be building for one, then sure. Why not? Uh reasonable ish. I don't know why I went to uh quartz ore though. Why did I why did I go to quartz ore? That doesn't make sense. Let's get rid of that uh Where's it trying to pull from quartz ore? Huh? I must be blind. Oh, it's here. Yeah, goodbye. Uh, I should say it's 7.4 glass. For one red, one per second. 43.7 megawatts. Sure. Green science. Green science, Ave. Not as long of a chain, but uh, we have a scroll bar for inputs. Uh, we have a scroll bar for inputs here. Doesn't actually look to be as bad on the power, but I haven't I haven't expanded all of this uh, out yet. Um, 
So with green science, the equipment chassis are the same, the optical sets are the same, the circuit board ones are the same. Rubber requires latex now, which is new. Uh, this is going to require biosamples, and biosamples are going to be mined for stuff. But uh, yeah, the the chain, the chain. And you'll notice red science stuff is used in green now, and that will continue going forward. Uh, there will be green science stuff that will be used in blue science. Speaking of blue science, welcome to blue science. We now need neuroprocessors for blue science and no longer need circuit twos. And this is going to require brains. We need to we need to put brains into our blue science. We're making blue science out of brains. Yeah. And we need nextlet matrix early now, earlier now than before. And yeah, lots lots of lots of stuff, stuff things. Glorious glorious stuff and stuff and things and 1.2 optical fiber okay 3.4 stainless steel okay purple science changed purple science changed the the blue is here for one uh it's stuff and I haven't gone fully down the rabbit hole with this but yeah let's just say it's it's a lot it's a it's stuff 4.2 next lit plates yeah I, I can make that happen purple science now has an entire cobalt processing chain an entire cobalt processing chain for uh, purple science exists now. That's new, brand new. There used to just be a cobalt alloy that got used after purple science. There is a brand new science pack called the Pi Science Pack. This thing uses blue science stuff as well as green science and red. So we have red plus green plus blue and red and blue ah <sighs> so yeah lots of lots of things even huh <sighs> even uh thing uh circuit threes circuit threes have changed you now need a neuromorphic chip for circuit threes, and that requires a whole bunch of stuff. So circuit threes have changed. Um, Biopolymer now has a method that uses less silver foam. Biopolymer now has a method that uses less silver foam. Which is fantastic, by the way. Just point point of reference. It's really good that it ha it uses less uh, silver foam. Okay, now in the last 11-ish minutes, after reviewing that again... Oh, hey, it's... it's... stuff. Um... Yeah, let's, let's just... let's just remove... die. I'm going to probably sneeze in a brief second. I feel it. It's coming. It's subsiding. It might suddenly reappear. Okay. Starting afresh with electric mining drills. That is not 30. Let's not do that. Uh, I need to make sure that I have enough belt to also process. Alright, what will be my orientation this way? Oof. 
I mean, that works. It's just... And I won't have the full... 30. Uh... There we go. You can go this way. As I said about belt, need lots. Um, actually, no. What am I? What am I thinking? I am. I am wrong. So at most, I can have fifteen. Yeah. Like uh, right now, the most I can have is fifteen. Uh, so we'll do sixteen. Yeah. So these these can die. The reason why 30 doesn't matter yet is because it's we're not going to be able to process more than a single lane uh, at the moment uh, when I set up the burner line, which will be uh, right here. I don't know off the top of my head how long the line needs to be, but what I do know uh, is that this will be coal. And that this will need power. Whoops. There's power for that. Uh, these can use burner inserters. Uh, so I'll do that and I'll leave it as is. I'll let the uh, iron accrue uh, in that. Uh, I will not need chromium before I get science, so I'm okay with covering over that with a belt. Actually, I'm okay with covering everything with a belt for now. It's all going to get demolished later. Oh boy, more belt, more belt. Uh, and I'm going to do a few tricks here with inserters as we go along. Okay. Power, power, power. Oh, come on. Uh, I I hate when that happens. There. Okay, then we need to get the uh I'll run the power along the belt. Got to get the power to the iron drills. Looks like I need even more, even more of the glorious power poles, uh, and even more belt. More belt, more inserters, more belt, inserters, belt, chests would be great. Lots of chests. Um, uh, so scale will be a thing that just happens. Yes, I put a tailings pond to be built um, that is on purpose and the gas vent for now will need those briefly but they'll be needed Ooh, I can build the uh, the DDC uh, what else what else do I need us uh, so we need buildings we need we need like buildings lots and lots and lots and lots of buildings uh, we're going to be handcrafting for the most part. I don't know how many of these steps can be handcrafted. So we have the basic substrate plus glassware. The glassware can be handcrafted. What about the rubber stoppers? The rubber stoppers can be handcrafted. The latex cannot be handcrafted. The agar cannot be handcrafted. Uh, 
partly because it uses steam for both of those. So there'll be things that need fluids that will need to be crafted in actual buildings without access to splitters or undergrounds. The joy of spaghetti. All right. Yeah, it would help if you had actually, you know, filled yourself with. Ah, uh, would it would have been nice if they actually put the things in themselves before they tried moving the iron over? But it's because the iron got here first. They, uh, they tried to insert the iron into the stone furnaces because the coke wasn't here yet. The coal wasn't here yet. Excuse me. Okay, now how many is it to do 7.5 again? 10. How many is this? 8. Because of course I'm off by 2. There we go. That should be enough to get the full output of the lane. Uh, it should be slightly backed up here in the long term because this is 16 and you only need 15. Auto save. Okay, automated iron is a go. Better automated iron. How's the power, by the way? Uh... Don't don't know. Oh right, that'd be that would be a good time then to start making radars. Very good time to start making radars and start building more mining drills. Copper is next. We'll need a lot of copper. We'll need a lot of copper. And remember what I had said about uh, doing belt to belt inserters for our splitters to use as splitters. 30 viewers! That is the first time I've seen 30. Thank you so much for coming on out and having a look at Pi Alien Life with me. Granted, <laughs> thus far the map hasn't, uh, we haven't gotten to that actual content yet, uh, and probably won't uh, until next stream on Tuesday. On Tuesday stream. But we have had a look of what is to come. Yes, to many, many more days with uh, with lots of people. Yes, viewers. Lots of viewers. Lots and lots. Now, I will note that we're still gonna, I'm still gonna have to figure out the uh, way in which the biotic stuff really functions, but that's gonna be after Red Science. We have a lot of work to do to get Red Science. We have a lot of work to do to get Red Science. Uh, a lot of this is familiar. A lot, of, a lot more of this is new. And much of this cannot be done by hand. So, gone are the days. Gone are the days of handcrafting your Red Science. Cannot handcraft red science from the base materials. You need to actually make some stuff first. Granted, because you don't have automation, because you don't have assembling machines, you uh, you can't actually fully automate this. You actually have to get agar and handcraft it into the uh, petri dishes. You actually have to handcraft the petri dishes. And you have to handcraft uh, from the moss step as well. Yeah. You have to do all that. Oh, right. There was... There was a very important thing that I had seen a little bit ago called sin gas made out of cellulose that I did not discuss at all but I, I was I was like wow that's a thing uh, so cellulose is wood and limestone in this case or fiber and sodium hydroxide you 
wood and sodium hydroxide. Uh, again, ew. Uh, or yatoi leaves, yotoi leaves and sodium hydroxide. Why? Why more things sodium hydroxide? <laughs> why? Why more sodium hydroxide? But uh, it's it's important because this is a brand new sin gas recipe. Uh, we have not seen this before. Also, gasoline from cellulose and manure bacteria. Well, that's one way to get gasoline. Oh yeah, that, that was the other thing. Uh, yeah, yeah, so... The first one for cellulose uh, isn't uh, sodium hydroxide. The other ones are. Lots of things need sodium hydroxide in the pie suite. Lots of things need sodium hydroxide in the in the pie suite. Uh, I was going to look up collagen. I was going to look up collagen. So collagen still only has skin, urea, and acetic acid. And there's still just this to get acetic acid, which is a little bit of a pain. But skin has many, many ways of getting it now, which is highly useful. And urea is s blood? Blood. Wastewater. Lock behind Dilmos Mark 1. Interesting. So it looks like now the most, the intended way of getting urea is out of wastewater. Cool. Good to know. Urea from, ahem, wastewater. Makes sense. Makes better sense than Augs giving you urea. Makes makes better sense than the normal way of getting urea. Huh. <sighs> anyway, it is that time, folks. It is uh, the end of the stream. I'm sort of sucks that all we got to was just this for iron rather than for, like, all the everything. But we spent a lot of time today discussing the changes uh, in Pi Alien Life. Lots of nice time discussing Pi Alien Life today. Come on, build the, build the stuff. Build the stuff while I, while I do the outro here so i would like to thank you all very much for watching on this uh initial little preview stream where we spent most of the time just looking at hell mod <laughs> uh we've, we we basically spent most of our time looking at hell mod and seeing what's uh updated what's changed what we have to look forward to uh you can look forward to my main content uh, on my YouTube channel, uh, including some videos that I am going to try to record going forward. Uh, one being an overview of Pi Alien Life. Uh, I will have an infinity mode map where I'm going to actually have the buildings placed down so we can actually take a look at the buildings, take a look at the handling of animals uh, in that way to figure things out. Uh, also, updated tutorials for the sciences going forward, including, I guess I need to do something about Circuit 3s, because that also changed. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, lots lots of work ahead for me. Lots of content to make uh, with a little bit more detail of uh, showing off these things. Uh, I will, of course, be streaming this again uh, on Tuesday 
And from what I can see here in our poll, I'll do I'll do uh, I'll do this uh, copy paste again into into the chat. Make sure that you give a vote uh, on that straw poll. So that I know your thoughts on whether or not to continue the other playthrough that I'm doing of Pie Odds Mods, the Pie on the Rails uh, playthrough. If you want to see that continue on Thursdays, or if you would rather me continue playing through Pie Alien Life and completely abandon that uh, so that we can do these things. Uh, going forward collagen buff apparently has just happened some sort of a collagen buff it went from 25 to 10 on skin i'm guessing so yes thank you that's that's a really good buff for collagen that is really good alien life will take a lot of time and with alien life existing how many people are actually going to be playing without alien life once it hits uh so this is this is my reasoning is uh f against doing the on the rails stream going forward is that once alien life hits who's actually going to be playing without alien life anymore so why continue playing through a map that is officially going to be outdated with the release of high alien life that's that's my point against continuing to play through that map. Ha, the votes are <laughs> the votes are off by a bit. So it's it's currently 87 28 87 and 28. Uh, I think that does actually put the lead towards abandon in its entirety. Uh it's 87 minus the 78 bot votes that were there, so that's 9, and 28 minus 20, which were the initial bot votes that had happened on this, so that is 8. It is 9 to 8. 87, 28. So, 9, 8. So, there is one vote more to abandon currently. We shall, we shall see how that goes going forward forward ha, that's him that's Ave's vote I guess yeah to uh, to abandon it yes it's it it is actually very close despite saying 87 28 is because there was like 78 and 20 uh, initially that were bot votes so yeah it's nine to abandon eight not to abandon uh, I'll Give it until uh, after the stream on Tuesday. I'll give it until after the stream on Tuesday, keeping that poll going. Uh, we'll see where the dice fall, basically, uh, for that. Uh, if it stays this close within, like, a vote, like, then it, it would come down to my vote, in which case, why even have the poll to begin with? But, yeah... My inclination is not continue. My inclination is not continue. And someone now has also voted against. So now it's a plus two on against. Now it's a plus two because I guess Akrem voted. Uh, and to keep playing the alien life. So the more times I stream alien life, the faster progression happens in alien life is uh, is the point so yeah we've uh, we've sat here and we've talked uh, enough at this point this is the end of today's stream i would very much like to thank you all for coming out and watching the uh the 20 some odd people that remain the 22 that remain we peaked at about 30 it looked like during this stream thank you so much for the uh the follows that happened i think we got uh 
three or four, four follows over the course of this stream, as well as a prime sub. So thank you so much to all of those folks. I will, of course, be coming back on Tuesday with more of the Pi Alien Life playthrough. Our Pi our Paidu Valley map. This is this this series is Paidu Valley. I'll be back with more Tuesday. Uh, and we shall see about Thursday uh, at this point. So thank you all for watching. This has been a talk to Showboat. If you have been watching the VOD on YouTube, please do not forget to comment, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and if you are so inclined, head on over to twitch.tv slash talk to Showboat to leave a follow to be notified when I go live. Sundays, Tuesdays, Thursdays from 10 a.m. to approximately 1 p.m. U.S. Eastern time you can do all of the social stuff through the links in the description below the video including supporting pyandon's mods development at patreon.com slash pyandon and myself at patreon.com slash butaku showboat caller is asking when does alien life drop whenever pyandon decides it's ready for the public to uh have uh there are a few things that uh king arthur is still working on that are broken uh so i would say expect it to drop maybe uh well not now but definitely uh, i'd say either between a few days to a week or more uh at, i'd say at least a few more days before uh alien life drops um at bare minimum uh just so that uh everything can get sorted for that so again thank you all and i will see you all on the next one